Not sure if it's Stockholm Syndrome or if the Arkansas Thotties are getting hotter. They're multiplying. Why are there so many Arkansas Thotties? Welcome back to the memes. That's Frank. I'm not the expert, and today we're playing some more MVP 07 NCAA Baseball. You guys hit the like goal of 20,000 likes the last time. Well, because you guys enjoyed the last video, we're back on it. This video is brought to you by MeUndies. When I partnered with MeUndies, I was thinking, am I going to have to show myself in my underwear on camera? Thank goodness they said I didn't have to do that. MeUndies, easily, hands down, the most comfortable pair of underwear I've ever worn. Personally, I prefer the Broxer briefs, but I think they have pretty much every kind of underwear you could want. It's kind of tough to describe. I guess the best way I can describe it is, it's like sitting on a cloud in heaven. They got every size you're going to need to, extra small all the way to 4XL. Never run out of undies or worry about skipping laundry again with the Me Undies membership. Each month, replenish your basics and build your collection with styles that are anything but basic. Styles that let you be your truest version of yourself, right down to your core. And no pressure, you can always skip a month if you want, plus enjoy discounted pricing, controlled shipping, and exclusive early access. Love your butt and get the membership. Take advantage of this special offer right now to get 15% off your order and free shipping when you use my custom link in the description below at MeUndies.com NTE. Once again, that's 15% off your order and free shipping when you use MeUndies.com slash NTE. Thanks to MeUndies for sponsoring this video, but now let's get back to the video. Whoop. You guys really wanted the Dynasty mode specifically, so I think that's what we're going to do here. But before we begin, I got to give myself an OP pitcher because I am pretty terrible at this game. Why can't I change his weight? It won't let me make him fat. So I really wanted to create Daddy Dirtbag and, you know, bring those memes back. Yeah, I can't recreate him exactly, but we'll try to make him a little sus, for sure. He's gonna be horrifying. Oh my god, that already is there. I'm really sorry about all of this. I just can't help but make people that are hideous. Reminds me of myself. <laughs> Look at that chin. Gotta make him super thick as well. Beefy arms, everything. But give him, like, the smallest forearms. Oh god, he's got that hourglass shape. We're gonna do the opposite of the other guy We're gonna give this guy massive calves and massive feet again It looks like he just put up like balloons or something in his pants. This is the slender man look if anything Yeah, we really got to cover up those eyes. That's just you can't even look at that those socks though Like how do you even make socks that are that wide? We need a bat stance that really puts emphasis on his calves <laughs> the tornado the helicopter Oh my god, look at that one. So that way you see his tiny little cheeks in between. I'm not gonna make him as overpowered as not the murderer, but he's gonna be pretty darn good at everything too. It's so funny when he runs too. Oh, we gotta give him max speed just because of that. Yeah, we gotta go with the sub. The one where he's getting down super low. That one just looks out of control. So he's got a really good fastball, a decent changeup, a nasty slider, and a pretty solid curveball. Old daddy dirtbag back in his prime. Well, that's cool. They got suspensions in dynasty mode. I'm keeping it on freshman too because I'm kind of awful at this game and I'm starting with a one-star prestige school which has A plus pitching, A minus batting, D plus fielding, and A speed. So we're honestly pretty darn good but our team prestige is garbage. Though we may be stacked but we got to prove ourselves to the world. Scouting poor. We haven't even started yet. Top guy is a starting pitcher and a third baseman. That's awesome. A two-way player. That'd be cool. Interest zero. Can we start talking to him, please, then? Attitude is poor. Academic average. Who even needs academics? Got 150 recruiting points. I have no idea how this is going to work. Let's have the recruit visit the school. And that's it. That's all our recruiting points right there. We have zero interested prospects. Tremendous. Wow, so we got not the murderer as a walk-on right now. Don't even have him on scholarship. Some guys have 40%. Some have 80%. That's pretty cool to see. I've never seen a game have like half percent scholarships and stuff. I guess baseball isn't one of the huge money-making sports at most schools. It makes a little bit more sense why they can't have everybody on a full scholarship. Top 25, we are nowhere to be seen on this list. We're 107th in the country right now. Gotta start Daddy Dirtbag versus the Charleston Cougars. And because Daddy Dirtbag is a legend, he's actually gonna be a DH this game. That way we can have the memes going constantly. Is it overpowered? Yes. Do I care? No. This interconference matchup features the College of Charleston Cougars and the Cluckers. It always gives it's me, the Cluckers. Oh, we got some hideous jerseys. <laughs> He's so ugly. Ugh. I don't know how you'd be able to bat against him because you could never look him in the face. You know what's hilarious to me is we are in the Pac-10 in baseball, but we're in Saskatchewan, which I don't even know the geographical location of that in Canada, but I can tell you it's probably not on the Pacific coast. You're so wide in the, the chest. Oh, a perfect one, and it's already in the field. This is going to be maybe a double. Can you get there? He's going for three. 
A triple to start the game? What the hell? Worst way to start it out, a freaking leadoff triple. We're garbage at everything. How are they hitting these? Get there, please. He's not gonna make it home. I'm gonna chase you down. Oh my god, did you see the movement on that? Three pitches, and we've already had three people hitting the ball. Can he make the throw? And he got him! So the shutout is still alive. That's what I'm talking about, Daddy Dirtbag. <laughs> they always run so funnily out to their positions. <laughs> no way that could be a strike. <laughs> He's just standing there. I, I forgot the controls for a second. I was like, let me just get a practice swing in. And that's gonna be a walk. Nice. Way to take it a full count to get this pitcher tired. Daddy Dirtbag, look at the cheeks. Oh, yeah. oh baby, that one feels good. And it's getting down. It's on automatic base running, so he might be getting inside the parker. Go, Daddy Dirtbag. He's running. He's got 99 speed, and he quit on us. Why did you quit on us? We wanted the inside the parker. The murderer. Oh, that one's got to be gone. What a cranker. There's the murderer when we need him. I uh, say so you can't sneak that one by him. Get down. We got hot bats today. Hot bats. Oh, man, he's going to just walk me in four pitches. <laughs> four pitch walk. They're trying for the double play. He's not going to make it. Oh, wait, they got him. Damn. Ooh. Oh, he was about to catch that. What the hell? What a freaking throw. Holy champions, I tell you. They're going to be champions. Good luck hitting that one. All right, this guy is screwed. He's about to get the most terrifying slider of his life. Holy good lord. It looked like it was coming at his face. This movement on that was insane. Holy god. You don't even have time to blink and it's already in the catcher's mid. Look at those strikeouts, man. Look, I know I gave myself overpowered players, but this is so much fun. Oh, straight to the pitcher. That's three pitches, and we're already out of the inning. That is just impossible to hit. <laughs> like, there's just no way you can hit that, man. The movement is insane, especially from his throwing motion, throwing it so low. Let's slow him down with a little slider. Actually, this one has some speed on it. You just cannot hit the slider. Woo, got him. Oh, man, I didn't think he was going to throw another strike at me. All right, Daddy Dirtbag, time to get on base. <laughs> That's got to be the worst power of all time. But look at him scurry over there. <laughs> it's so silly. And the way he keeps his leg up. Ripping it. Been on base two times. They got nobody there. The pitcher's too slow. Let's go. It worked. Accidental check swing turning into a bunt. That one's going to be caught, isn't it? Nope. Oh, wait. That's the end of the inning? Boo. I want a complete game for me. I want the shutout. Get there. Nice. I'm going to make him chase for this one on the outside. Ooh, got him. Got another one in three pitches, too. Oh. The pitchers are learning. Last time we beamed him right in the face. Oh, is it going to get over? It's over the wall. That one is gone. Hell yeah. He left that outside the zone too. It was pretty high, but we still swung on it and cranked it. Oh, what the hell? This man just dove out the way for absolutely no reason. Oh my. What are y'all doing? Daddy Dirtbag's going to go out there and punch somebody square in the nose. Okay, don't mess this one up. Get out of here. Get out of here. Let's go! Can't leave me a pitch high. First hit of the day for him, and this one's over the fence. Oh, we might have another one. Back to back. Daddy Dirtbag, the pitcher. This one's gone. New pitcher now. So I say you give a back to back home run. It's time for you to go. This might be off the wall, actually. No, it's probably going to be right in front of it. Oh, it's off the wall. Let's go! The field of nightmares. Working out in our favor. 
Oh, off his ankle. Can he get there? Yes, hit the pitcher. That's what we want to see. We hit their face last time. Now we're hitting his toe. Come on, bring him home. Oh, the palm ball. They got a guy who can throw a palm ball. <laughs> it almost hit him in the face. I want to hit him in the face. He's lucky he didn't die right there. Get there. And that's the ball game. Complete game shutout for the ugliest team in the world. Only two hits allowed for Daddy Dirtbag, 10 strikeouts. He also scored two runs of his own with two hits and two RBIs. Simulating these other games for the series. And it looks like we went 3-0 in that series. 4-2 in the next game, 2-1 in the final. If we do a long series for this game, I think the best way to do it would be doing like one game per month, choosing the team I want to play against, probably the highest rated out of the bunch, and then we simulate the rest, because I play like 60-something games in college baseball. That would give us four games for the regular season, then we move to the conference championship, and then the postseason after that, which is the, probably the most fun parts anyway. We won 17-1 against FIU, holy moly. And we lose our first game. We lose 7-3 to FIU after crushing them 17-1. We lose another one. Wow. <laughs> they got real pissy after we beat them. We lost another one. Three in a row. Level 1 Bat Sponsor Challenge. Several top bat manufacturers have expressed interest in sponsoring our program. If we hit eight RBIs as a team in our upcoming game, we might be able to pick up some level 1 sticks for the team. Ooh, that sounds awesome. Jay Jackson has been suspended for six games for his part in an altercation. Whatever. Just let it keep on simming. Guy doesn't even sound like an important player. Oh, the game was rained out. Yes, we got it. Boom. Double header and we won them both. Hot start to the year. 10 and 3 in our first month. We are ranked nationally at number 39. So if we play this series again, we will be in March. And then we can decide who we want to play. We got Sacramento State, who probably looks like an easy win for us. I don't even know who UCR is. We got Townsend. And then we got Stanford at the end of the month, who's ranked nationally at number six. After simulating our first month, we have one of the better records in our conference. And of course, the All-America team is going to be not the murderer at the top. Same thing with Daddy Dirtbag. They're looking real strong out there. Not the murderer is 11th in the country with five home runs. He might be leading the country in RBIs. He is with 26. Daddy Dirtbag has 10 stolen bases. He's third in the country at that as a starting pitcher is hilarious. And he has 16 runs scored. Two of the best averages in baseball, not the murderer and Daddy Dirtbag in the top five. After pitching 41 innings, Daddy Dirtbag's ERA is 1.09, the lowest on the team. He has four wins and one loss. One of our goals for this year is getting one of our pitchers eight wins. And I think we're going to accomplish that pretty easily with Daddy Dirtbag. As always, if you're enjoying these videos, make sure you hit the like button. Whenever these videos get a ton of likes, it shows me that you guys are engaged with this series and enjoying it a lot which is the best way for me to come back and decide what to record next. But anyways, I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends of my book, and as for me, I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace. Thank you to Patreon supporters Jack Webb, Zach Harper, Anthony Uhas, Timbo Slice, Cameron Tipton, Richard Pizer, Tristan Sagner, Kobe Cochran, Seth Washburn, Matt Woodruff, Rosalie Jarecki, Colin Kohler, and Timothy Stanson. 